Today is um, Friday, March the 3rd. It's exactly 1.15 p.m. And your girl just did that unboxing. Y'all, we got a new camera. That's it. That's all. That's the post. Period. And it's been a long eight days. I'm, it was ordered, what, February the 24th, I think. I'll insert a screenshot. So I've been waiting. I'm, I'm just like, y'all, and it's it's white it's so cute <laughs> so y'all we are back and i'm looking in this view honey i gotta get used to this all over again but y'all i'm so excited but um yeah i'm gonna get off this camera looking like this i just wanted to document this moment because honey it's up in this stuck stop what shy who <laughs> nobody period so yeah y'all i'll be back in a little bit bye Hey y'all, so it's another day of a video. <laughs> I just showed y'all me and Bruno playing for a little bit and before um, I lay down, I just wanted to introduce um, the vlog and say hey. Today is Saturday, March the 4th. Um, like I said, it's like 8.30, 8.40 a.m. I'm about to take a nap. I have a NOAA client later. Um, and also y'all, we have a new project we are starting. And we get in this boy's room together. That's it. That's all. That's the post. So yesterday I went and got the paint. It was two different color paints. Um, the doors, you know, and the walls are two different colors. So I went to do that. I got that mixed up. Um, my rental office gave me the code, you know, the numbers so it can match. And I have to go get some paint brushes and, you know, stuff like that. So we'll be able to paint his room. Um, yeah, we have to move furniture out, y'all. Kids is trifling. I don't care what's the age. 18, 19, 2, 3, 4, 5. These kids need to get their lives together, y'all. Because it be like, god damn. <laughs> but, yeah, so we're about to do that. Um... I hope you all enjoyed the 1K giveaway. Let me know how you all liked the footage. I thought it was really, really nice. Y'all, I got Mylon on this TV. So, if y'all hear... <laughs> I love Mylon, y'all. <laughs>
Branders. So I thought this part of the video, I would just, you know, give y'all some little, you know, a little voiceover to explain the process and what I've done so far. And through the B-roll, I was just prepping her nails. She um, comes and gets a full set and she just bites her nails off. She uses a card, whatever. So her nails are always like, they look like they're damaged because that's just her. But anyway, so right here, I'm just showing you all after I prepped the nails, glued the tips on, filed, shaped them to her desired shape. Um, she was looking for inspo. She always goes on Instagram to try to find, um, you know, what she likes. But we end up going with that blue that I showed you all. And it's so pretty. It looks like a Tiffany blue. So that's me um, after I had laid the acrylic. And right now, what I'm doing is just going in and um, shaping up and cleaning up after, you know, your acrylic is applied. And I am a nail tech who believes in acrylics. I don't like gel polishes. I'm not her. So basically, every set you've ever seen, um, it's all acrylic. And shaping is everything for me. Um, I stand by it. Um, that's my brand. That's what I'm known for is my shape. And her shape right now um, is going to be Coffin. One of my favorite shapes to do, but my all-time favorite is Stiletto-type almond-shaped nails. Um, I wear those a lot myself. Now here, after I shape, you know, with the foul, I go in with um, our e foul, And that's where you clean up the cuticles and you just make sure everything is nice and smooth. Um, this process, it depends on how you lay your acrylic, you know, it's all in your foundation. So if you lay your foundation, you know, um, smooth with no bumps and thin and, you know, it'll turn out just how you need it. So you won't have to put in a lot of work with your wrist. Um, and here my final step is always to turn the nail towards me just to make sure that the tip of the nail is even, it's straight, it's smooth. Um, I love to go in with a hand file just to clean up the edges, make sure everything is flat. You know, just my little techniques of what I do to make sure that my branders are branded. <laughs> so I just speed it up through the process here, y'all. Um, T has been coming to me the whole six years I've lived in Georgia. She is a favorite all time. Don't cheat. She don't play. <laughs> this is the one um, y'all have seen in previous videos that I always say she gives me a run for my money. <laughs> but now I'm going in with the buffer. And this is the final part. This makes the nail um, extra smooth. Just so when you go to, um, if you use polish or whatever, it'll make it smooth. And that's just my cute little blinked out little duster that I blinked out. Y'all already know I love bling. Always clean up after yourself, period. Um, and this is a cuticle oil that I mix together um, that I use on all my clients to end the process before, you know, I design or do whatever. Um, and definitely after you apply this, you make sure that you let them wash their hands. Tell them to put the soap on the cuticle, rub soap, because you want to get all of the oil off the nail and hers look amazing. I love her set, y'all. And she ended up wanting some designs and stuff that you will see um, here in a few minutes. But she always, always is satisfied. And I'm always, always happy to brand her because, honey, she be, she be popping with her nails. And she goes from long to short, so... Yeah, that's my girl T. And here, y'all, Bruno was obsessed with scrunchies. So we're about to go um, to the Dollar Trois and get him some scrunchies. Like, y'all, he was having a ball the whole time with this guy that going scrunchie. I'm like, Bruno, I didn't pay all these money for these bones. And, honey, they had him going. Like, after they left, he was knocked out for the rest of the day. <laughs> But, um, yeah, Bruno, he's he's the star of the show now, y'all. Everybody loves Bruno. But, yeah, y'all, anyway, so after she has washed her nails and stuff, here's the process of me designing um, her nails. 
and I'm just going in uh, with a thin brush and making lines and um, giving her her look. And I really, really love them. And I'm using gel polish. This is just a regular um, white French tip gel um, polish. And I do use like gel polishes to do lines and designs. Um, sometimes I use hand paints um, that come, you know, in the little jars or whatever. But here I am using gel. And under her is my gel light that I got from Amazon. And I can link it below for you all. Um, it really works good. I love it. It's so elegant looking. So, um, yeah. So, we're going to design her nails. And I'll show you all the end and result of her branded Nails Talk too. Stay tuned. <laughs> Back like you owe your tax, owe me 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 back like you owe your tax. Y'all, they just caught this girl stealing, honey. She's up here fighting the people. I can't. Why? Look at her. Yo, people is crazy. Don't make no sense. Mm -mm -mm.
up my branders? Welcome or welcome back to the channel. I'm your girl Bridget Nicole. If you're new here, I ask that you would please stop, hit that subscribe button, and become a part of my branding family. Let me know if I'm supposed to touch, touch, touch.